Fox 21 and the Colorado Springs Independent teaming up once again for this year's Give campaign. We're highlighting local organizations that need your help. Tonight we're joined by Debo Dead and Jose Alvarez speaking on behalf of Peak Education. So thanks for coming in tonight, guys. We appreciate it. Well, thank you so much for having us. And we no really want to thank the Independent for choosing Peak Education to be one of the nonprofits this year. Such a great campaign that they put on. I know it really they put is. so much hard work into it, too. So yes. we appreciate them as well. Tell us a little bit about Peak Education and what you guys stand for. We are in our 15th year and it was started just as a grassroots organization by two local businessmen, mm -hmm. um, Dr. Dalton Connor, who is a periodontist, and Steve okay. Mullins, an attorney. And they had been talking about how wonderful it was to raise children in Colorado Springs. And they loved having their families being a part of the community. Mm -hmm. And they wanted to give back. And as they looked around this, the community, they felt that there's a whole population here, of very bright, intelligent students who have very strong cultural and economic barriers mm -hmm. um, to life and to education and to having their dreams fulfilled. So they started an organization that would help them. It was a scholarship program. Nice. And they promised a scholarship to people like Jose when he was in seventh grade. <laughs> and you say the word scholarship and everybody's ears perk up. Yes. Because that's huge. Education is so expensive. So tell us how it helped you, Jose. Well, it's actually been a long road for me with yeah. peak education ever since I started back in 2000 when I was a student in seventh grade. And looking back even further, my earliest memories were with my parents. They worked as migrant workers. Oh, wow. And so my earlier memories were there on the cucumber fields with them. Wow. And they always encouraged education because they said they didn't want us to end up like, like they did. And however, I knew the goal, but I didn't exactly know the way to get there. Yeah. And so I feel that Peak Education has come in with that because they provide students these opportunities and networking that may not be available to them otherwise. And for me, that's, that's how I met some of my great mentors that I've had that have been leaders in the community. That's how I learned about my full ride scholarship that I was able to get to go to school. And now I'm being able to fulfill some of my dreams that I had when I was younger, you know, being a homeowner, graduating wow. from college. That's and huge. Yeah. I'm jealous and of that. <laughs> <laughs> and now that I have a job that actually makes a difference in engin yeah. engineering, and I'm able to give back to the community and to, to some of the students as Peak Education has helped me. So what's the highest scholarship that they can obtain through Peak Education? Well, that's interesting because even though we started as a scholarship program, uh -huh. we learned that what the students needed more was um, experiences that sure. helped them understand uh, life be outside of poverty. Mm -hmm. So that became our focus and now what we do is we help students get outside scholarships. So we were helpful with Jose getting a full ride scholarship. And was that the governor's scholarship? That was the Kane scholarship. That was the, of course. And the Kane ride. family scholarship. Full yep. ride. Anybody I know would take a full ride scholarship. Exactly. Well thanks to both of you for coming in tonight. We really appreciate it and congratulations to you. Thank you. That's something to brag about for sure. I love it. <laughs> well if you would like to give to the campaign you can do so by going to our website fox21news.com and click on the give logo you'll find it right at the top of our home page